I want to call the car and I crashed right into the diaper factory. Now I'm in pain every day and I can't move my body. Bernie, thank you so much for sharing your story. Yeah, I can finally see why driving safety is just so dang important. It's like all of our decisions make a difference, guys. They led us here. I started drinking when I was only 14 years old. It was 2006. Me and my buddy Ronald were at this antique store checking out some old baseball cards. Very nice. <laughs> <laughs> hey, man, check this one out. <laughs> Look at those cyber. I know, right? Guess the price. A buck. Whoa, 200 bucks. For a dumb card? That's crazy. Wait, is that booze? I spotted a collection of antique liquor bottles. The crazy thing was a lot of them were still a quarter full. Ha! There's still liquor in me! Ronald, shh. Keep it down. You stole alcohol? Well, I figure they're only selling the bottles, so... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Anyways, we got totally wasted. Wow, that old stuff sure packs a punch, huh? Look at all these spoons! <laughs> that is cool. We should get drunk and go to the antiques yeah, market yeah. every oh, weekend. Yeah. <gasps> what is that thing? What? John Denver Collector's Plate. Huh? Who is that guy? Be careful, buddy. Come here, Johnny boy. <laughs> Whoa. I fell right into the cabinet. I was okay, but I broke like $80,000 worth of stuff that day. Were the spoons okay? Uh, yeah. But I had to work there for four summers just to pay off the damages. You're just lucky you didn't get alcohol poisoning and die. Serves you right for doing something so stupid. Oh, come on. Like you didn't do anything stupid in your teens? Um... Uh, the MySpace challenge sends local girl Alexa Pompey to hospital. Who wants to go next?